What's up guys, JV2017 here, and today Infinity Ward released their single player campaign trailer for Ghosts. Now this is not going to be one of those videos where I'm like, I'm so excited, here's the trailer. I'm actually going to go through the trailer with you guys and talk over it. So if you want to just see the trailer by itself, this is not the right video. So anyways, these are tweets from Infinity Ward. Yesterday they said something new is coming tomorrow, and they teased about a 10 second uh, chunk of this thing, and I was like, what is this? And it showed an Odin strike. So um, today, they finally released it, so I'm going to go over it with you guys uh, frame by frame, and we're going to see what we can get out of this. Starting us off here, we're seeing exactly what we saw in that 10 second teaser yesterday from Infinity Ward. A bunch of space warfare and shooting and explosions, and we'll see the Odin strike, which you guys know the Odin strike is one of those field orders that players can complete in multiplayer and will completely change the map, kill, you know, kill the entire other enemy team. That's crazy stuff. Right here you're seeing what's called kinetic bombardment. So this is a science fiction kind of concept. It's not really a thing that's real, but in the 50s uh, we had something called Project Thor where uh, scientists were like, hey, if we shoot tungsten rounds into the ground, you know, it'll cause this kinetic bombardment and just screw everything up. And that's where I think this campaign is going. Um, some kind of enemy force is shooting tungsten rounds into the ground, blowing everything up, causing this huge disarray, and it's kind of like a home front kind of battle. I mean, we saw that Hollywood sign there a second ago. Um, right there, that was a baseball stadium. Of course, we have the map Strike Zone and Multiplayer. Uh, it just looks like that's the kind of campaign we're going to be playing in Ghosts, and of course, our protagonists, the good guys, are Ghosts. They are these stealthy you know, operative, badass, special ops dudes, and that's who we're going to be controlling and playing as. So, you know, overall, I was thoroughly impressed by this trailer. It looks really, really nice, and I don't know if it's just the pre-rendered cutscenes or what. Either Infinity Ward got better at making trailers, or I don't know. It just doesn't look as crappy and just, you know, f phony action BS, you know, anymore, in my opinion. That's what I've been seeing from this trailer and kind of the vibe I got from it. So, uh, what you've been missing from me talking over it is basically just a big dialogue narrative from an old guy who's like, this is war, we fight for our country, we are ghosts, you know, that's basically the gist of what the dude is saying. So, uh, back to the tungsten rods, that, the tungsten rod, like science fiction, whatever, uh, is actually from, it's not from, but it was used in G.I. Joe Retaliation, if you saw that movie, uh, the enemy, the Cobras, they shot tungsten rods from Earth's orbit into the ground. You know, they're kinetic projectiles. If they hit the ground fast enough, they're going to make just a massive explosion. And that's kind of the concept behind uh, the enemies who they mention in this trailer are south of the equator. So we know kind of <laughs> very generally where our enemies are from who are going to be fighting in ghosts. So... Anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. I hope you learned a little bit more. Uh, I have not read all the spoiler things about this game. There are, apparently, the entire story is spoiled on the internet, but I am not one to go look at that because I don't want to be spoiled in case I do want to play this single player. So, hope you guys learned something new from this trailer and looks pretty solid, not going to lie. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I will talk to you later. Peace. Alright, I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you did, please remember to click the like button, I'd really appreciate it, and stay tuned for more ghost coverage on my channel very, very soon. Peace!